Hey brothers and sisters, it's Brother Matt back with another message from the Lord to share with you today. Today's message is from May 11th, 2023. It's part of the longer Easter to Pentecost series. If you're new to my channel, then I encourage you to check out the other messages that I've been posting so you can see uh, some of the other things that the Lord's been saying. Uh, as always, I'm grateful for everybody who likes these videos and subscribes to this channel and comments and especially for those of you that have shared this message with others. I have tried to record this message about 20 times. And every single time I have tried to record it, there has been some something, some disturbance, whether it is loud cars passing or an attack of insects suddenly, or my throat suddenly not being able to get words out because I'm coughing or some other nonsense but i am going to get it out this time i am determined there is there's some challenging things in in the message i'm going to share with you today and uh, i pray that the lord would speak to you and give you discernment and wisdom about how they apply to you and how you should respond even now loud vehicles passing by because that's how it is but we're going to push through brothers and sisters so this is what the Lord gave me May 11th, 2023. I'm just going to read it just as he gave it to me. It says, I, the Lord God, maker of heaven and earth, the great God, the King of kings, the Lord of lords, I will speak to you, O servants of the Lord. Say to the peoples of distant lands, I see you. There is no place too far for me to reach you. No land so distant that my word cannot reach. I will call you out from the far reaches of the earth. I will draw you unto myself, O peoples. I will blow through your lands as a great wind. I will sweep through your cities and draw many sons and daughters to myself. I will come to you in dreams and visions and reveal myself to you. I, the Lord, and calling all peoples to myself. I will be attested to by miracles, signs, and wonders. Among you, O peoples, you will give glory to my name. You will lift up holy hands to worship me in all your tongues among your tribes. There is none that will be hidden from me. I am the Father who sees all in all, who knows the end from the beginning. I have placed you in the lands at a time such as this, that you might seek me, that you might search and grope for me. I will be found by you. Give up my people, O nations, O kings, O princes of the lands. Surrender them to me, for they are mine. They are my own. I will loosen your grip on them. I will set the captives free. I will shake them out. I will sift them like fine grain, for they are mine. I will move them from the borders of one land to another. I will move them from their places in order to bring them to me. They will push against the gates until the gates are opened. They will try every door. They will push against the fences until the fences collapse and the way is made for them to come to me. Do not despise the foreigner among you, O oh my people. I am bringing them out for the time that I have prepared. I am bringing them to your doorstep. Therefore, whoever welcomes them in my name welcomes me. Tell my people, call by my name. Do not despise those I bring to you. Have you not considered, O oh man, I have brought them for my purpose, to reveal my glory among the nations. I, the Lord, have spoken. All the peoples of the earth are mine, and I will bring in the full number of my flock. 
I am the good shepherd. My sheep will hear my voice when I call, and they will come unto me. They will not come for another. Rest now in me, O servants of the Lord. That's the message the Lord gave me May 11th, which I'm sharing with you today. Um, reminds me in some respects of Acts 17, where Paul talks about how the peoples of the land are arranged in all of their places that they might search and grow up for the Lord. Um, I pray for you wherever you are that you would be blessed. I know many people have put prayer requests in the comments. I want you to know that when you put those prayer requests in the comments, I do pray for you. And I know that others who uh, are participating in this channel pray for you also. So brothers and sisters, be encouraged. Pray for each other. Pray without ceasing. We know our Lord is coming soon, even though we don't know the day or the hour or the time. We know that he is coming and we will stand firm and we will continue until the day he comes. So I'll see you guys next time. God bless.